Welcome to the History of Simple Things, where we delve into the fascinating history behind the little things that shape our world. When you're driving down the highway, you might have noticed the massive trucks sharing the road with you. These giants of the road, often weighing tens of thousands of pounds, carry everything from groceries to construction materials. One thing that sets these behemoths apart from your average car is the braking system they use. Unlike passenger vehicles, which primarily use hydraulic brakes, big trucks rely on air brakes. But why do these heavy vehicles need such a different braking system? What makes air brakes the preferred choice for big trucks? And how exactly do they work? In this video, we're going to explore the fascinating world of air brakes, diving deep into the reasons behind their use in large trucks and the mechanics that make them so effective. To understand why big trucks use air brakes, we first need to grasp the sheer size and weight of these vehicles. A fully loaded semi-truck can weigh up to 80,000 pounds or more, depending on the regulations of the country it's operating in. With such immense weight, stopping these vehicles requires a braking system that is not only powerful, but also reliable under extreme conditions. Hydraulic brakes, which are commonly used in cars, rely on a closed system filled with brake fluid. While this system works well for smaller vehicles, it can be inadequate for the demands of a heavy truck. One of the main limitations of hydraulic brakes is that they can fail if there's a leak in the system, causing a complete loss of braking power. This is a catastrophic risk for a large truck where a brake failure could result in devastating accidents. Air brakes, on the other hand, are designed to overcome this potential failure. Unlike hydraulic brakes, which use fluid, air brakes rely on compressed air to operate. This fundamental difference provides several advantages that are crucial for heavy vehicles. First and foremost, air brakes are fail-safe. In the event of an air leak, the brakes will automatically engage, bringing the truck to a stop. This is because the brakes on a truck with air brakes are typically spring brakes, which are held in the released position by air pressure. If the air pressure drops, the springs automatically apply the brakes. This built-in safety feature is one of the key reasons air brakes are used in large trucks. Now that we understand why air brakes are necessary, let's delve into how they actually work. The air brake system on a big truck is complex, consisting of several components that work together to ensure the vehicle can stop safely and efficiently. The primary components of an air brake system include the air compressor, air tanks, brake chambers, and various valves and lines that control the flow of air. The process begins with the air compressor, which is powered by the truck's engine. The compressor's job is to pressurize air and send it into storage tanks, where it's kept until needed. These tanks are crucial because they store enough compressed air to allow the brakes to be applied multiple times, even if the compressor stops working temporarily. This redundancy is another safety feature that ensures the truck can stop even in the event of a compressor failure. When the driver presses the brake pedal, air from the storage tanks is released into the brake lines, traveling to the brake chambers located at each wheel. Inside each brake chamber, there is a diaphragm or piston that moves when air pressure is applied. This movement pushes a rod connected to the brake mechanism, which in turn forces the brake shoes against the brake drums or discs, creating friction that slows down the truck. The amount of braking force is directly proportional to the air pressure applied, giving the driver control over how much braking is needed. One of the unique aspects of air brakes is the use of a system known as the dual circuit. In most trucks, there are two separate air circuits, each controlling different sets of brakes. This design ensures that even if one circuit fails, the other can still operate, providing braking power to the remaining wheels. This dual circuit system is yet another layer of safety built into the air brake system, highlighting just how critical it is to ensure these massive vehicles can stop reliably. 
A critical component of the air brake system is the air dryer. As the air compressor draws in air from the environment, it also pulls in moisture. This moisture, if left unchecked, can condense in the brake lines and tanks, potentially freezing in cold weather or causing corrosion and other issues. The air dryer removes moisture from the compressed air before it enters the storage tanks, preventing these problems and ensuring the brake system remains reliable in all weather conditions. Safety valves also play a crucial role in the air brake system. One such valve is the governor, which controls the air compressor's output based on the air pressure in the system. When the pressure reaches a certain level, the governor signals the compressor to stop compressing air, preventing the system from becoming overpressurized. Additionally, there are pressure relief valves in the system designed to release air if the pressure exceeds safe levels, protecting the entire braking system from damage. While air brakes are incredibly effective, they require regular maintenance to ensure they function properly. Given the critical role they play in a truck's safety, neglecting air brake maintenance can have serious consequences. For instance, worn-out brake shoes or drums can reduce braking efficiency, while leaks in the airlines can lead to reduced air pressure and potential brake failure. Truck drivers and maintenance crews must regularly check the air brake system for any signs of wear, damage, or leaks. This includes inspecting the air compressor, air tanks, brake chambers, and all associated valves and lines. One of the most common maintenance tasks is draining the air tanks. Even with an air dryer in place, some moisture can still accumulate in the tanks over time. Draining the tanks regularly prevents water from building up and ensures the air in the system remains dry. Additionally, checking the slack adjusters, which are responsible for maintaining the correct distance between the brake shoes and the drums, is essential. Improper adjustment can lead to reduced braking power or uneven brake wear, both of which can compromise safety. Given the complexity and safety features of air brakes, it's clear why they are the standard braking system for large trucks. The ability to automatically apply the brakes in the event of an air pressure loss, the dual circuit design, and the robustness of the system all contribute to making air brakes the ideal choice for heavy vehicles. Unlike hydraulic brakes, which can fail completely if there's a leak, air brakes are designed to maintain some braking capability even under adverse conditions. This is especially important for trucks that often travel long distances, sometimes through mountainous terrain or in harsh weather conditions where the brakes are subjected to significant stress. Moreover, the scalability of air brakes makes them suitable for trucks of all sizes, from medium-duty trucks to the largest tractor trailers. As trucks grow in size and weight, the air brake system can be easily adapted to provide the necessary braking power without requiring a complete overhaul of the system. This flexibility is another reason why air brakes are the preferred choice in the trucking industry. In summary, big trucks use air brakes because they offer a level of safety, reliability, and efficiency that is essential for handling the immense weight of these vehicles. The fail-safe nature of air brakes, combined with their ability to function under a variety of conditions and the built-in redundancy of the system, makes them the ideal braking solution for heavy trucks. Understanding how air brakes work reveals the engineering brilliance behind this system, which has been refined over decades to ensure that these massive vehicles can be brought to a stop safely and reliably. So the next time you see a big truck on the road, remember that the air brake system is one of the key technologies keeping both the truck driver and other road users safe. Thank you for watching. If you have suggestions for our next video, feel free to share them in the comments below. We'll be sure to give you an acknowledgement for your contribution. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the history of simple things. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more stories woven through the smallest details.